and I think that God deserves a thank you. Look at the gift that we would have said is not around. That devil is a liar. So can we give him thanks? My victory is in your blood. My confidence is in your name. You took the shame so I can shine. So much you did without a price. My victory is in your blood. My confidence is in your name. You took the shame so I can shine All this you did without a price That's why we sing It means thank you
healing service. He has taken away the bad report and given us joy and victory. See the way he has lifted you. Hey. Canada. Let's do this together. This Thanksgiving service. While we were worried and could not sleep, he was walking behind the sea. No, he has taken away the shame, hey! given you joy and victory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Just pray in the spirit. Something, the, the, the atmosphere has just changed. The climate has changed. I'm going to release the sound of the trumpet right now. A prophetic sound. We, there's been a lot of prayer in the back end for this outpouring, and this is not a concert. The sound of the trumpet will signify a couple of things. It's a prophetic announcement that is a new day. In Canada, in Toronto, in Ontario, that the king has that revival is here, that his kingdom has come. We're not joking. If last year or so we were we, we, we went to London and released that sound and things shifted. Lift your hands. Things are going to shift. The sound of the trumpet would also release mantles on people when you shout. Tonight, three is my prophetic number. You see, I was sharing with my brother that the, the sort of confirmations I got for this event, I would have, we would have stepped out on just one of those confirmations, but I got about four of them. And God speaks to me, you know, a couple of ways in word witness from time to time, dreams and visions. I, I've got a strong knower, and then many times through, you know, signs, tokens, and similitudes. I was going to my hotel room yesterday in New York, and then the Holy Spirit just witnessed in my heart, look at the date. Sorry, the the number of your room it was 333 three. I made a transfer on GT Bank and one of the codes came back as 333 three, three. I said what's this 33 three? it was when I flew here when I, was, when, I, when I was about to land I said oh today is the third of September 9 multi, another multiple of three So we're going to release this sound three times. And God has given me some little grace that whenever we release this sound, he shows up. Thank God for Dunsi and I and, you know, a couple of the rest of us. But God sent us here to, to conscript some other Dunsis and Nathaniels and Victorias. So as I sound the trumpet, the psalmist mantle will rest on people here. God did not bring you to Canada to live a good life. It was for the God life. He sent you here to establish his kingdom. He sent you here to lift up the gates. I was in a meeting like this years ago. Dr. Panam was ministering. And something entered me. And look at the ripple effect. I don't know who is here tonight. I don't know who came here fasting for an encounter as I blast this trumpet you will feel literally a, a cloak come upon you I want you to pray in tongues for one minute something's about to rest on you prophets where are the prophets where are the intercessors by God by God by God as I mentioned intercessors something lived where are the intercessors those who will say give me Toronto or I die Hey, where are the apostles? Fire is about to come on you. Yesterday I saw the Niagara fall. It's going to come like the fall. When you hear the sound of the trumpet, every time I blow the trumpet, you will shout fire. Another thing the sound of the trumpet will cause is the breaker's anointing. Ah. We carry a breaker's anointing. Who are thou, O great mountain, standing before Zerubbabel? You have become a plague. I see great and effectual doors. Open. I'm stirring you up. I'm stirring you up. When you hear the sound of the trumpet, you will release fire. Are you ready? We'll sound in three times. Keep praying in the Holy Ghost. If you are here and you can't pray in the Holy Ghost, there will be a baptism of fire. This is an outpouring. Agbarak, 
Mantles are dropping. I'm going to worship the Lord shortly. We came to activate some people. There are people who will live here tonight and suddenly you will know why God created you. Your purpose will be unveiled. It's happening right now. It's happening right now. The voice of the Lord will be activated. The prophetic will be activated. The miraculous will be activated. Romans 15 verse 9. Give me Romans 15 verse 9. Oh, through mighty signs and wonders from Jerusalem to Illyricum, Paul preached fully the gospel of Christ. Some people are receiving new tongues. There's a baptism of fire. Some of you are feeling heat on your hands. You are feeling warm.
when we come in your name you are with your name be you are God with us and the one who lives in us in our your name my dear Someone is sensing his presence strong. He's sharpening your awareness of him. There is a river in this place already. Just drink, drink from it. Very soft.
Someone is finding their love again. Somebody is finding their love again. Just the sisters, the ladies alone, sing. You sing it like you're whispering, like, like you're whispering. Sing. Exalted in the earth. The king of glory is in his temple. This is a song of heaven. This is not a song I would have written. Heaven sang it and I heard it. Say your name, lift your hands to him. Something happens whenever I sing this song. A river is released. Healings. Intimacy. It's throne room worship. Oh, it's exalted in the 
soldi di notario mi dà soldi in Toronto in America is a weight the glory of God is called the cabot is waiting is waiting is coming on someone is waiting you feel like a weight is coming Can you give us the spotlight? We don't want anybody seen on stage. Just, just give us a spotlight. Let him be him. He's, he's taking the stage right now. Adonai, we introduce you right now. Take the stage. When his presence Sing Adonai 
Sisters sing Adonai, sisters Lord. That spirit that has been tormenting you lives right now. Sing God or Everyone sing God or nine without the music. I do see I, I, I sense a leading in my heart keep, keep playing I sense that the gosha is about to burst the fountain of the deep is about to burst please can I crave your indulgence if, if Prosper is still here you and I join with him we sing this and then we go to out of your belly shall flow rivers of your belly. Yes, 
to surrender their lives to Christ now. If you miss this moment, it's like missing destiny. Wherever you are, you want to give your life to Christ. Find your way to the front now. Now, now, now. The 
This is not a time to be ashamed. This is why we came. This is why you came. This is why we came. Yes. There's no need to talk too much. The Holy Ghost Himself is convicting. In Acts 2, in the day of Pentecost, they said, Was our Lord not come? If you are not in Christ, you are not saved. Find your way to the front now. to the cross he saw you he went for you for you open your mouth right now and express your heart lord i'm sorry have mercy and you know the irony there are people in this room right now that you are supposed to find yourself here make your way before we make this prayer I'll count to seven. One. Two. Find your way to the front. Find your way. Find your way. Find your way. Three is calling your name. 
One more time. Say, oh. Oh. Thank you, Jesus. You know why I'm saying this? Because as soon as you turn back, the enemy will come for you and start equipping you. This is the best thing that can ever happen to you. See, the day you give your life to Christ is the day you start to live. Because you were separated from God. It's like a product that's separated from the manufacturer. You can't function well. Now, today is that first day that everything begins to realign. Let me tell you, angels are rejoicing now. You are so priceless. Jesus went to the cross for you. Put your hands on your chest. And please... Confessions are powerful in the kingdom. With mouth, with the heart, man believes. But with the mouth, makes confession unto salvation. So what you are about to say now, not just mere words. It's about to change your life forever. Say, Jesus. Say, I come to you today. Say, I ask for mercy and forgiveness of all my sins. Say, I am sorry. Say, I ran away from you. I did some bad things. But today, I make up my mind to come back to you. Say, I plead the blood of Jesus to wash me away from every iniquity. Say, I plead the blood of Jesus to wash me away from every sin. Say, from today, I declare that I'm a new man in Christ. All things have passed away. Say, all things have become new. Say, I live a new life from this moment. Say, the Holy Spirit now comes into my heart and into my life to help me, establish me, and perfect me, and present me unto the day of His appearing. Say, I have decided to follow Jesus. Say, no turning back. Say, praise God. I am born again. Say it one more time. Say, praise God. I am born again. Everybody, can we say it together? Say, praise God. I am born again. Your life just changed now. Congratulations. is a new season for you. Come on, come on, guys, come on, guys. Hey, hey, hey. We 
gave you some parts and some materials and then he will help you. Because this is more like you have to learn. You have to learn how to heal. So he gave you some materials. Is there a place we are making them? You know. Yes. So he gave you some materials to help you establish you. My team, our team is going to tell you the next things to do. How to be established in the church and so on. Please, can you touch your right, my left, and just follow the gentleman raising his hand there. We just want to take like two, three minutes of your time. And we are coming back. They are coming back to join us. Please, can we welcome them into the beloved? Hallelujah! Listen, we have three more things to do tonight. And they are very important. Please stand to your feet. They are very important. Nobody should move. They are very important. Don't miss your moment. You know, meetings like this, when the Lord sends his prophet, there's a prophet of God in the house that we're about to bring off stage in some few minutes to release some very dangerous proclamations upon us. And I don't want you to miss it. I don't want you to miss it. I don't want you to miss it. So please give us some few minutes and then there's going to be after party. But before then, the Lord was speaking to me twice I prayed. And he said to me, it's prophetic that you are in this kind of arena. Because this is the stadium. This, this is an ice hockey stadium. And the Lord said to me clearly, Isaiah 90, a people who are stuck in darkness, unto them has appeared a great light. And he said to me, he said, from this day, our stadiums will not only be known for sport. Please believe me. It will not just be a place where they gather for sport alone. It says, I am initiating another wave of tent and stadium revival. Believe me when I say, I am initiating another day of tent and stadium revival. Watch out. Our stadiums will again be filled. Not only to watch football or to watch sport, but we will gather together to meet the king of kings. And I want uh, Pastor Nathaniel, we are going to release Olorun Agbaye. Yes. Olorun Agbaye as a prophetic sound that this moment, this Kairos moment, just initiated upon the body of Christ, then and stadium revival. And you will see what will happen after this. So we are going to bring out your phones. Put on the light. We are going to sing this song. Raise an anthem that we echo in Asia. Echo in Africa, echo in Europe, echo in North America, in South America, in Antarctica. Please, can you rise to your feet? Oh, yo, 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 And the head shall be filled with the knowledge of your glory. Yes, God. Yeah, 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 yeah. Listen, you are good, you are kind, but you are born and deep. Lost for words, trying to describe. Elohim, Elio. Hallelujah, we your greatness is all I see. What there is nothing you cannot do, there's no mountain you cannot do. Why, if you have said it, then you will do it.
Please welcome me 